Hello everyone, thanks for clicking this video. In this tutorial, we will guide you through how to set up and utilizing labels for your investment. There are many different ways to use labels. If you use more than one broker in a single portfolio, you can apply a label to your holding so that you can track where you bought them. You can also tag investment strategies to your holding using labels. For example, you can purchase a holding by its growth, dividends, or value. Creating and using labels will help you organize your holdings based on your own criteria and make it easier to keep track of them. Please note that this feature is available exclusively for our investors, expert, and share site professional plan. Let's dive into applying labels from an individual holding page. From the overview page, Select the holding you want to add a label to. The individual holding page, when you scroll down, you will find on the right hand side of the page the section called Label. Click on the drop down and click Manage Labels. Enter a label name and select all the holdings that you want to be labeled with the same name. Once you have finished selecting the holdings, click Create Label to complete the action. You can create multiple labels and if at any point you want to delete a label, you can always click on the bean icon to remove the label. You can also create and manage the labels from your performance report. Click the Reports tab and select Performance Report. Click on the drop-down arrow next to Filter by Label and click Manage. You can create new labels from here or attach new holdings under a pre-existing label by ticking the specific holdings. Then click the attach button next to the label name you want these holdings to be labeled as. To sum it up, you can create and manage your labels from the individual holdings page or the performance report. You will find the different labels you created when you go back to the portfolio overview page and scroll to the holding section. Each label is displayed as a color-coded dot, which you will find beside each holding. And when you hover over each dot, it will reveal the label name. For instance, you can differentiate between different brokers you have used, like Comsec, SelfWealth, and Stake. Each broker has a unique dot color. Once you have created your labels, you can view their performance by running the performance report and filtering the report based on your labels. You can choose to group your investments using the default groupings, custom groupings, or no groupings. And once you have selected your groupings and time period, you can now filter the report based on a specific label by clicking on the drop down next to Filter by Label. Selecting the labels you want as filters and clicking Save. You'll be able to see the filtered performance report using the labels and review the price, quantity, value, capital gains, dividends, currency, and overall annualized return. If you are looking for a way within share sites to tag and identify your holdings, the labels feature will certainly help you achieve that. If you have any questions, please comment down below or on our website. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel to stay up to date with the latest investment insights. Also, don't forget to follow us on social media for more content. We'll see you in the next video. Bye!